Yo, so it's currently 7.38 p.m. right now, and I, I don't know, I just felt like recording this, um, you know, different angles, so maybe c get a couple more viewers, hopefully. No, but all jokes aside, um, I just wanted to rant about the state of a lot of new coders, and perhaps you're a new coder and, you know, you're a bit lost and you don't really know how to go about approaching code um you know i was once a, a new self-taught coder and i would say right now it's a lot more difficult to be a developer than it was at least 10 months ago and i say that because of the, the amount of content online now is really scary for the developer like they don't know they're like over saturated with content and if you're a developer and like you don't know what to do and you're a bit scared on like what position to take and what to do a good frame of mind is to just go with a uh, simple and basic attitude about learning code and by that I mean just go with what you feel is right go with what you want and just do the bare minimum to get by so rather than just worrying about what the new framework is what the best language of all time is in coding just focus on what you want so focus on what language you want to do and the career path that you want and just work towards that goal you know a lot of people on here will try to sell you courses i'm not naming any names i'm just saying like there's there's people that will just want to sell you courses and they'll make a problem out of the blue to sell you the solution and generally speaking you don't need that thing so just find a way to mute out all the content and just a good, good frame of mind is just to focus on what you want to do and again do the basics as much as possible don't overthink what language you need to do don't overthink who you need to talk to. Don't overthink the content that you watch or what platform you learn code. Just try to learn code every day. Do the lessons on whatever platform you're choosing or tutorial that you're choosing and try your best to improve. So I'll end on this story because I, I know there's a lot of self-taught developers and sorry for my hair. Um, it's just been a long day. Okay, I'm going to take a shower. Um, What I'm trying to say is, you know, like when I was starting out, I, I, I was always lost. Like I was always looking at content and I didn't know what to do. So I went to Code Academy and then I made the switch to Free Code Camp. And then I did the Odin project at CS50 and a bunch more things. And what I found was, although, although I thought I was making progress, there wasn't really anything going on. I wasn't making progress because I kept switching. When, if I just stuck to one of the lessons, you know, maybe free code camp lessons and just did my best at that thing, I would have been better off than just constantly switching and finding the new best method. So f for you watching, if you're like a brand new developer, you know, you're you're ready to go. You want to be a game developer, uh, web developer, whatever it is, just be as simple as possible. There's a lot on your plate. So just leave it. Okay. So I'm going to start doing this segment uh, totally unedited right now. I'm just going to post this, no thumbnail, no nothing. Um, and this segment will just be me ranting about the coding space. So by now, a lot of you guys would have gone. So to the 5% that are watching this, you will get um, really good content on something that doesn't really matter on that sense. Um, the coding space is just so annoying with this stuff. You know what I mean? Like... There's so much content on really just bullshit things where it's confusing you. Matter of fact, it's confusing me. You know, who cares what language you watch? Who cares what watch? Who cares what language you write? There's no best language. There's no best language. The best language is for you, okay? The best platform is the one that works for you. When I was a personal trainer, this is what the frame of mind I gave my clients all the time. Do what you're comfortable with because that's the thing you'll do best in. There is no best workout. 
There is none. Because if there's a best workout, scientifically speaking, there is. But if you hate that thing and you never actually do it, then you're never going to see the progress because you're not putting in the effort. So you might as well just find what you enjoy, do that thing over and over again, because then you will see results no matter what, because you're enjoying that thing. So how this relates to code and what I'm trying to say is who cares what language you do? Generally, who cares? You know, I joke about Java developers looking like old guys. That's just a joke. Okay. I'm, I'm fucking around. Obviously, I don't have any hate towards Java developers. I do. I'm kidding. Just do something. Okay. You know, don't let these trolls just say otherwise. Like I was on, I was on TikTok the other day and someone was making fun of me for teaching someone how to write in HTML. I know that HTML isn't a language. I know that. I'm not like saying it is. But these people were trolling the newbies like indirectly and saying that, oh, HTML is too easy. It's, you know, everyone uses React now. No one uses HTML and vanilla JavaScript. Cool. Cool. So what? Like, so what? Why did it go? <laughs> so what? Seriously. So what? All right. Just do the basics. Be as, as basic as possible. Do what you're comfortable with and just improve. If you do those things, you will just get better. You'll just get better. Stop overthinking it. I've had multiple DMs from people. and I love every single one of you watching. I swear to you, the 1500, 1500 subscribers that are watching this, I freaking love you. But when you just DM me saying like, I'm lost and I don't know this and I don't do that. Like I get it. And I want you to DM me and stuff like that. And we can talk like I'm always for that. But you know, a general rule of thumb is like, I hope you're watching this video is just be as simple as possible. You know, like don't let some guy say you'll never be a developer for doing this or you web developers are going to be replaced or like some shit like that. Just don't let someone else make that opinion of, of you or your, of your uh, career. Just do the work. Try to improve. You'll reach that goal eventually because with the right effort, you will make it and you'll see what you do from there. And if you're a new developer, that's all you need to do. I swear to you, if you take anything, just understand that if you just basically just do something for a long time and just try to improve on it, you will make it to that goal. You know, they say that in the gym. They say that in school. They say that in coding. I don't know why I'm like, just do the work. Okay. And that's all you need to know. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you were enjoying my rants. Um, this is an unfiltered one, unfiltered video. So if you enjoyed this, then let me know. I love y'all and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. -bye.